What is up guys? I am back um, with kind of a strange video. We are looking at today the best cameras for starting YouTube. Now I have been doing YouTube for I have been doing YouTube for about seven months. You can see my very first video at the bottom right there, Skylanders episode one. Um, so yeah. So I've been doing YouTube for about seven months. Alright guys, to start off this list, we're just going to go with your iPhone. This phone has a pretty good camera, as is, right? So we're just going to go to the video. You can see it has a pretty, you can see me there, it is very tight, but you can see it does have a pretty good camera, alright? So, obviously, it ain't as good as this one. Let me shine some light on the subject because it is dark in here. I can't. Okay, good to know. Alright, um, I guess this has been exposed. The video's not on the internet yet. So, yeah, that's happened. But, um, so the number two camera I recommend for, um, YouTube is a GoPro. Um, so this is the Activon CX. Um, this is, isn't quite a GoPro, but it does the same function. Good quality for a GoPro, but I just will have you know, it is very hard to stare at um, distorted video for as long as what a vlog would be. So, um, yeah, I had the sim similar problem because this used to be my vlogging camera. Now this bad boy is. So, GoPro at number four. Sorry for the noise. All right, so at number three, we have a point and shoot. This is a Nikon Krupex. It is quite a bad camera, but um, you know, you can you can kind of see the quality there. It, it is kind of blurred out, but yeah, it is very quite close to it. But that's basically what it is. 720p for this guy, but um, as far as point and shoots go, I do recommend the Canon G7X or Canon G7X Mark II, because, I mean, they're fabulous cameras. I don't own um, any of them, but um, here is a picture of the Canon G7X Mark II. Ta-da! Coming in at number two on this list is the Canon 70D or 80D. I don't own any of these cameras, but um, many famous YouTubers use them, such as Casey Neistat. Ta-da! And you can fit a microphone on top, so um, that is number two. Ta-da! And finally, guys, at number one, I'm gonna go into the bathroom so I can show you. Here it is, the um, Sony A5100. I love this camera. Um, obviously, I have the Joby Gorilla Pod attached to it. Th this isn't included. I can even snap this off if I want. So, there we go. So, this is basically the camera. Um, 1080p fineness. That's it. It's a great, great camera. I wouldn't trust any other camera. So, this is the camera that I use, and I just recommend it to anyone who tries to start YouTube. Um, I bought this camera for around, um, what was it? You can, you can see me right there. I bought this camera for around, I think I bought it for $600, and I got an SD card, which is like 64 gig, and that was like 50, and this little guy was 20, so this is around a $700 setup. Um, so I recommend this one. Um, let me put you back on the little pod for a second. Well guys, I hope you enjoyed this mini video. It was a small one, but I just wanted to get something out there for you guys to enjoy, and I know there are a lot of starting YouTubers out there, so I thought I'd help you guys just a bit if you're looking for a camera. Um, obviously, I number one recommend this camera, but um, yeah, thanks for watching the video, guys, and we will see you in the next one. I'm, I'm shaking you to get off the video.